what's going on YouTube uh, I was gonna come and show you a little shotgun update this is my Remington 870 Magnum Express 12 gauge shotgun uh, with the side saddle uh, barrel extension I've been working on this gun for a little bit I've, I've put a little bit of work into it uh, and I finally got his pistol grip on here uh, it took me forever to find a pistol grip that actually fit an 870 you can find them all day long from Mossberg uh, you can even find a bunch of them for uh, Winchester but 870 it's it's rough uh, I'm seeing lots of stuff uh, lots of pistol grips that say 870 on them but they won't fit none of my 870s and uh, the guy at one of my local gun shops uh, poor guy he's thrown about a dozen of those away because he'd take them out of the box and try to fit them to my shotgun and none of them will fit and he had to do some customization to them to see if that will work and uh, and it don't so he, he's thrown about a dozen or so away felt sorry for him but uh and you guys saw my shotgun sl uh, sling I changed it did some uh, fine uh, rigging to get it to uh, to make it into a one point sling it's a heavy one point sling with all these uh, shells loaded up uh, I got everything in this thing that I would possibly need. I got some slugs. Uh, I got some, I think that's six shot, six or seven shot. Got a Hornaday critical defense buck shot in there. Uh, one more thing, a six shot. And then I got a uh, Remington buck shot down through here. And then I got more Remington buck shot right there. Uh, all these are standard two and three quarter shells. Uh, I got that's my seven. This gun holds eight. I keep the, the chamber empty. That's the uh, your first warning. I got seven of these. The Winchester game load two and three quarter uh, six shot. Uh, I do live in an apartment that is the front door of the apartment uh, if somebody comes through that front door they're going to meet this thing as you can see the gun is unloaded so don't freak out but they'll see this end point at him and across the hall I have uh, a neighbor that has two little girls and I couldn't bring myself to think that if somebody broke in and I hit him with one of these buckshot and uh, it goes through the dude uh, possibly through the door and into their apartment even if it you know it just falls through the the drywall and just falls in I still kind of forgive myself thinking one of them got it hurt or something so I use uh, the six shot uh, Cause I heard that at uh, a certain distance they won't go through drywall, which is all that is. These are thin walls, so I need something that uh, will struggle to get through it, as opposed to the buckshot. <laughs> uh, to go over what I've done with this gun, uh, of course, put the pistol grip on here, put the sling. Uh, mounted side saddle on there I got this new 20 inch barrel or old 20 inch barrel that I got I got this barrel on the shotgun before I really even uh, started making gun reviews put this new pump on here uh, that way I don't come all the way back that the help fit for the side saddle because if it has a standard uh, pump it stops about right here so the, I'll have to rig that up 
have to saw on it or something and I just said screw it and I'll just put one of these on there uh, got mag, uh, a two shell magazine extension uh, with this little liner upper thingamajigger uh, other than that that's all I really done to the shotgun I have shot this shotgun I have shot it one handed before and uh, it's hell on your wrist uh, multiple or multiple shots taken with this shotgun uh, in about the 50 round range or 50 shell uh, like you can't lift your arm the next day because your elbow is fucking killing you the, your wrist is killing you it sucks <laughs> but uh, it, it's fun to shoot uh, I kinda do want to just get the standard butt stock put on there uh, I want to get a Mossberg 500 the, the pistol version and, uh, and if I get that then I'll just put a regular butt stock on there no problem I'll just try something a little different pretty sweet but with that Uh, don't really want, know what more to say, so I'll go ahead and end the video and load this thing up and put it right back in the bedroom, right beside my bed, and uh, leave it there until I need it. Thanks for watching.